I am absolutely delighted to welcome you to our third IFTAR here at the RGS. I am delighted that RGS has such a brilliant multicultural society. It is so important that our school reflects our local community and that is really, really important to us. So we are a registered charity in the UK. We've been working for over 15 years. We've been working towards social inclusion, educating the youth, trying to bring harmony, coexistence and bringing together communities. There's two things that we have in Islam that are highlighted. One is patience and the other one is great gratitude. Sabr wa shukr. The pious say they're the two wings that you need in order to fly. The Prophet, peace be upon him, used to worship in the last 10 days of Ramadan as he has never done at any other time. We should pray, read the Quran and do dua. What the church has lost is families worshipping together. But most definitely, as Muslims, you seem to have really embrace that and been able to keep that fantastic tradition going because you believe so strongly in your faith. And I think that is a truly wonderful thing. Allahu Akbar, Allahu Akbar. Allahu Akbar, Allahu Akbar. Ashhadu an la ilaha illa Allah. And it was like a really nice thing to bring everyone together and like all share a meal and everyone was just socializing and talking with each other. I thought it was really well organized. Um, the food was delicious and I think it was really nice to see the community come together. People who didn't even know each other just sat together, came together, spoke, shared food together and that's the best thing about the iftar. It's always a joy to come to the RGS in any event um, and it's a, it's a great example of community integration where actually people are just comfortable to celebrate that this is Ramadan and it's iftar and we're sharing together. It's just so nice for people to be able to understand another religion that we wouldn't have access to at all. It softens the hard, the hard side of Islam that you tend to see on the news. It's my first time here and it's the first such event I've attended in my children's school and it's very encouraging, very promising. The best thing about this event, in my opinion, was the food. <laughs> Al alongside the speech given by Sheikh Tanvir as well. I'm going to try and do see if you, we can get a similar um, event going in Slough for our families and our communities. Yeah.